good. <laughs> now all I need is your Johnny Hancock. Don't go get in a case of the reluctance now. There are consequences for not playing ball. Oh, well, consequences. You haven't mentioned consequences in, like, what, ten seconds? Ooh, touchy, touchy. Now, signy, signy. This better work. I need you out of my house and out of my hair as soon as possible. <laughs> Thank you, hubby. Catch you on the flip side. Hi, Dodo. Bye, Dodo. Your secret is safe with me. Well, your secret may be safe with Star, but with me, not so much. AJ, what are you doing here, Connie? Shouldn't you be in Shady Brook? Oh, yeah, I broke out of the loony bin to come to the office. Are you sure this one's yours? What are you doing here? No, really, you should be in a straitjacket. Trey and Sonny took you to court. <laughs> and boy, was that judge pissed at them for wasting his time. <gasps> I'm in the clear, sweetheart. What judge let you run free? One that believes in truth and justice and knows a little crap when he sees one. What's his name? No, absolutely not. You are hey, not getting away combat. with what you did. You Just... murdered Colin. No, I did no such thing. You don't want to take my word for it? Why don't you ask your old dad? Tell her that I didn't kill her boyfriend and her little girl. Why should he? We both know that you did it. No, I'm innocent. You've been blaming me this whole time it was Kate. She and Sonny have pinned this on me for forever. Would you just shut trying... up? You're such a freak. All right. I'm gonna give you a pass on the insults this once. Don't do me any favors. I didn't think you'd believe me, so I'm gonna refer to public record. In the court transcripts, you will find that a shrink testified that I, Connie Falconeri Zakara, am the original, and the Ice Queen, formerly known as Kate Howard, is the altar. That's a lie. No, it's not a lie. It is the truth, Star. Kate put Trey in the drawer. Kate shot out Anthony's tires. Right, and Nikki Smith is the real Victoria Lord. Can you just Lord. listen to me for a second? Kate's been playing everyone for years. She's the one who took your little baby girl from you. It is disgusting when you lie to me. It is even worse when you pretend to be sympathetic. All right, Please. you know what? You can deny it all you want, but the truth is out, and I've been exonerated. Which brings me to the reason for my visit. What would that be? I have my freedom. Now I want my magazine. You had... Pony up, Manning. Mama needs a new pair of shoes. I don't give magazines to imaginary women. Huh? Who the hell do you think you are? Connie Falconeri Zakara, editor-in-chief of the soon-to-be relaunched Crimson Magazine. Get this straight, lady. I don't care what kind of scam you and Johnny pulled over on that judge. I'm not buying it. My father is not buying it. He is not giving a magazine or anything else to the woman who... He's not giving a magazine to the monster that murdered his granddaughter. I'm very sorry that you lost your family, Star. All right? They were innocent. But I can't do anything about that now. All right? I got my own life to live. I got a magazine to run. What do you want a magazine for, anyway? Share my style with the world. You really think the world needs more jungle prints and tube tops? Mm, you let me worry about that. Good luck getting your magazine back, because my dad owns the company that owns your magazine. And he's bound contractually to give me the reins. Or face penalties. What's that supposed to mean? Check, check it out. A binding contract that provides me with complete control as editor-in-chief, regardless of who runs Crimson. Sorry, Star, there's not a lot of wiggle room in this. Just scrape. Hey, hey, don't be mad. Star. It's just business. Star, Star. Star! Satisfied? Almost. See, there's just one more thing. I'm gonna need my office back. You want this office back? Effective immediately. No. Get out. <laughs> I ain't going nowhere. Crimson's gonna be a real hit with the semi-literate. Well, with what you're paying me, I can afford ghostwriters. Okay. I gave you a magazine, okay? You can't have my office. You want office space? You've got an entire building here. You, you can choose another space. I don't want this office. Well, I want a strong moral center and a shorter rap sheet. Today's not a day when people get everything that they want. This office is occupied. Uh, if you read the terms of the agreement, any violation will be a fallout for you. Okay. Do you remember... When I held you hostage, and I ordered my associates to not kill you. You wish you had? I still have their phone numbers. 
This office is a line in the sand. It is fixed. It is, it is unmoving. It is... These are not the droids you're looking for. Are you going to give me the office? No. Is that your final answer? Yes, it is. Fine. Never let it be said that Connie Falconeri Sakara does not know how to share. No, 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 no. Say hello to your new office mate.